Is protein restriction helpful or harmful for longevity? There's an ongoing debate in the longevity field regarding protein intake. How much protein is ideal? When to take it during the day? What type of protein to take or avoid? And whether protein is net beneficial or harmful for longevity? As you're likely already aware, diets that are higher in protein have been shown to help us feel fuller, eat less carbohydrates, gain muscle, and lose fat. On the other hand, diets that are restricted in protein, especially branched-chain amino acids that are often found in animal protein, could offer potential longevity benefits through inhibition of mTOR, a nutrient-sensing pathway which results in improved mitochondrial function and autophagy, or cell recycling. As with most concepts in nutrition, there's a trade-off. Where I've personally landed on protein is that maintaining adequate protein intake is net beneficial, especially when the alternative is often a higher carbohydrate diet, though when possible, eating the protein in a smaller time window, such as only lunch and dinner, to still get the longevity benefits of protein that come with an intermittent protein fast.